Introducing the NMC Horizon Report 2013 Museum Edition, a publication of the New Media Consortium and the Marcus Institute for Digital Education in the Arts. The Horizon Report features six technologies placed along three adoption horizons that indicate likely timeframes for their entrance into mainstream use for museum education and interpretation. On the near-term horizon, within the next 12 months, are BYOD and crowdsourcing. BYOD or bring your own device, is a practice that emerged as a result of the increasing number of people who take their laptops and other devices with them everywhere they go for maximum productivity. Many museums take advantage of this by offering mobile apps for wayfinding, sharing, and curating purposes, taking the pressure off of institutions to purchase devices in bulk to lend to patrons. Crowdsourcing refers to a set of methods that leverage the ideas and work of a community of individuals around a common goal, like Wikipedia or Kickstarter. Many museums use crowdsourcing to promote community engagement through social media, prompting visitors to submit observations and media to add an interactive dimension to events and exhibits. Two to three years from adoption, electronic publishing and location-based services are on the midterm horizon. Electronic publishing is creating a change in how people consume media, research, news, and narratives. Rich in digital media assets such as video, images, and audio, these digital building blocks can be easily deployed in a variety of media formats aimed at discrete audiences, a notion that has huge implications for expanding the reach of a museum's content. Location-based services are already so integrated into people's daily lives that few think twice before allowing mobile apps on their devices to track their location. For museums, location-based apps and other technologies can knowingly guide visitors through a space, directing them to exhibits that match their preferences or suggesting routes with accompanying digital displays and features to interact with. On the far-term horizon, four to five years away from mainstream are natural user interfaces and preservation and conservation technologies. Natural user interfaces are closing the gap between humans and computers as new platforms emerge that incorporate touch, voice, and other gestures. Technologies beyond the touchscreen are rapidly advancing to make human-computer interaction even more intuitive, compelling museums to rethink the way visitors engage with art and objects. There are a fair share of museums that have already incorporated tablets and multi-touch displays to reinvent exhibits and allow visitors to become part of the installations. Also in the far-term horizon, preservation and conservation technologies. For years, museum professionals have been exploring ways to protect and repair both physical and digital objects that are in peril of becoming obsolete due to rapidly changing technologies. Establishing workflows for developing and archiving metadata, in addition to documenting the artist's original intent, will be key for the advancement of preservation and conservation. These six technologies are described in detail in the report, along with specific examples and further readings. The report also discusses significant challenges and key trends associated with the adoption of technology in museums. Download the report now for free at go.nmc.org slash 2013-museum or on iTunes U.